Hey, Rodney, thank you. That was a great workshop you just put on. You shared some great, great information with the agents, and I appreciate that. No problem. Thank you, Joe. You know, looking back to last year, now you closed 45 transactions, you that's, and your wife. That's right. Uh, just under $10 million in production. Yes, sir. What really interests me is the six years you and your wife have only been in the business six years. Uh -huh. That's a tremendous amount of business. If you had to look back at the last few years, what have you done to set the groundwork to obtain such great results? Well, you know, Joe, out of those 45 transactions, uh, half of them came from short sales. About three years ago, my wife and I made a transition into the market where we saw it going, and we said we need to get into the short sale market. So that really helped us out back then. Yeah, I remember a lot of the agents in here, they were uh, referring a lot of clients to you because a lot of people in the beginning didn't want to work right. with them because they're, they're stressful. They're, it's tough. Very but stressful. you guys have mastered it and done a great job. Now, I noticed in the last few months, you have seemed to expand your business. Uh, explain that to me. That's right, Joe. You know what? This short sale market's not going to last forever. So looking forward, we want to start making the transition now so that when the market of the short sales are gone and over with, we're still strong in the market with our presence. So what we're doing right now is doing a lot more marketing, doing a lot more mailers. We mail at least twice a month to our different farms that we have. And also we're out there making contacts every day. Interesting. 25 contacts a day minimum. And you get results from that? Most definitely. That's interesting. You know, look, let's, let's wrap this up. But uh, if you had to give advice to, let's say, a newer agent out there or somebody who might be stuck in a rut or whatever, and if I said to you, pick one or two things that you feel are most important to your success, right. uh, or to anybody's success for that matter, what might they be? Two things come to mind, Joe. Mindset and attitude. When I'm talking about mindset, I'm talking about keeping your mind focused on being at work at a certain time, showing up, like you've always told us, show up. Also, reading books and educational CDs, listen to educational CDs. That's important. Also, attitude. When I'm going out there, talking to the people in the public, making sure I'm excited, letting them know that we're here for a long period of time. So when you come to work every day to the office every morning, is your day planned? It's scheduled, ready to go? Yeah, every hour. Interesting. I'm doing Interesting. something every hour. So time management is very important too. Very important. Interesting. And you know what? I've really realized that within this last year, doing so much business that we do, if we want to get to that next level, it's got to be even more precise. Great information, Rodney. You know what? Congratulations you. on your continued success, and thanks for sharing your time with us. Thank you very much, Joe. Appreciate it.